iodine and plastic bag to fusion. This experiment shows the movement of particles through a membrane. For this experiment, you will need starch solution, iodine, a dropper, and a zipper plastic bag. Procedure. Mix the starch solution in the water in a beaker. With the help of the dropper, put some iodine solution in the zipper bag. Zip up the plastic bag. Now turn the bag upside down to check whether there is a leak. Submerge the bag into the beaker with the starch solution. Leave the arrangement for half an hour. A layer of deep purple black color is formed on the membrane of the plastic bag and the color swiftly diffuses into the starch water. Explanation Iodine is used to test for the presence of starch. When iodine reacts with the starch, it turns deep purple black. The iodine molecules are small enough to pass through the membrane of the plastic bag. However, starch and water molecules are too big to pass through the membrane. The movement of the iodine through the plastic membrane is functionally the same as the movement of the molecules through the biological membranes, that is, any cell membrane. The molecules will move from higher concentration to a lower concentration. Osmosis is the net movement of solvent molecules, in this case iodine, through a partially permeable membrane, like a plastic bag, into a region of higher solute water concentration, in order to equalize the solute concentrations on the two sides. Here, by partially permeable membrane or semi-permeable membrane, we mean a permeable to the solvent, but not the solute. Diffusion is that physical process in which any solvent moves without input of energy across a semi-permeable membrane, separating two solutions of different concentrations. Thanks for watching, and be sure to subscribe for more cool science experiments.